Hello everyone and welcome to a new episode of Digital Trends Summer Edition, curated by Serena I. Mokta in collaboration with Non Origin. This week's theme is Neon Lights. Enjoy! Electric Ship No. 4 is a thousand photographs of neon lights that have been taken, catalogued and fed to a generative adversarial network. The result is dizzy, strangely sexual and hypnotic. Blast from the Past pays tribute to long-gone days full of VHS movies, video games and neon dreams, all coming out a pink-coloured extra-dimensional portal. A neon-lit vending machine stays lonely in the middle of a deserted city street. Tokyo-based photographer Matt Dreams Neon captures a moody picture in neon drinks. MCHX creates beautiful and colourful compositions that look like cover pictures of 1990s experimental techno-jazz music albums by obscure bands. Enlightenment by Ghost Cowboy is a cryptic scene where cutting-edge technological materials are mixed with long-lost magic. Three cape figures observe five floating spherical entities. Phoebe Brain's Joy Against the World is an easy take on vaporwave-inspired fashion. The jacket seems perfect to be worn while visiting Neon Tokyo or Blade Runner's futuristic Los Angeles. We do not know what is transported in special delivery by Neon Wasteland, but it surely feels like something out of this world. The pixel art is detailed and every corner of the animation tells a story. Sudo shows the most typical vaporwave scene in Riding with the Vaporwaves. An ancient Roman sculptor rides a sea turtle floating on a synth wave surface. Midnight Metro, created by Nimbus the Sky Kid, is a chrome filled hallucination. The colorful characters riding the metro mirror the jazzy color palette. Sfei Yes is a photographer working in Hong Kong, and in last night, one of his latest work, the artist brings a nostalgic discovery of a big neon sign that lights an empty street at night. Thank you for watching this episode. See you next week.